Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Jalinder Karande and today I'm going to walk you through the cost optimization service for Snowflake built by the innovation group at Entity Data. There are strong query performance optimization methods available in Snowflake, which includes materialized view, clustering and search optimization. Every optimization method is designed for different scenarios and it's used in wrong scenario may not give you the desired benefit. Further, customers may end up paying higher cost for the wrong choice of optimization method. This motivated us to build a cost app that is cost optimization service for Snowflake. This video explains briefly cost app along with its block diagram and example dashboards. COS app is designed as Snowflake native application. This is high level block diagram of COS app. The building blocks of the COS app includes logs and users analytics, a recommendation engine, a scheduler, and the customer interface. In addition to the Snowflake native app, COS has an external component that's Streamlit dashboards. The log and users analytic module is responsible for processing information from Snowflake account users and Snowflake system functions with the help of various Snowflake store procedures and user defined functions. The recommendation engine model is responsible for generating performance optimization recommendations from the summaries built by log and users analytics model. This recommendation includes what is the right size of the warehouse for the workload, what is the utilization of current warehouses, what needs to be done to reduce Snowflake credit consumptions, what needs to be done to improve the performance of the workload, what performance optimization method should be used considering cost and performance benefits, and what are the optimal parameters for performance optimization methods. For example, if clustering is decided to use, then what should be the clustering keys? The scheduler model is responsible for triggering the execution of cost app, that is log and users analytics model and recommendation engine model on a periodic basis. The customer configures this periodic interval and the default value is one week. The customer interface model provides the ability for customers to interact with COS app. This ability includes reading recommendations, initialization of COS app, and starting execution of COS app on a schedule. All this interaction with COS app are through SQL for the simplicity. The dashboard model is responsible for visually representing summaries built by log and users analytics model. This is very useful in taking design decisions on a Snowflake platform. All dashboards are designed using Streamlit and Snowpark capabilities of the Snowflake. Let's move to COS app UI. Snowflake uses dashboards from COS app help you to identify costly set of services, users, databases, and queries. Warehouse analytics dashboards from COS will help you to identify warehouses that are underutilized or costly or not on a right size or on a right configurations. Clustering can substantially improve the query performance by co-locating similar rows in the same micro partitions. The more frequently the table is queried, the more benefit clustering provides. However, the most frequently the table changes, the most expensive it will be to keep it clustered. And therefore, the clustering is generally the most cost effective for tables that are queried frequently and do not change frequently. So these dashboards from COS app are helpful to finalize the tables for clustering and then the clustering key on that tables. 
Materialized views are designed to improve the performance of queries that are repeated most frequently. Materialized view is pre-computed and stored result from query defining view. Because the data is pre-computed, the querying a materialized view is faster than executing query against the best table of a view. This performance differences can be significant when the query is run frequently or is sufficiently complex. So these dashboards from course will help to take design decisions about which view should be defined as materialized view. Search optimization can significantly improve the performance of point lookup queries in Snowflake. To improve performance for point lookup queries, the search optimization service relies internally on a persistent data structure that serves as an optimization search access path. A maintenance service that runs in the background is responsible for creating and maintaining the search access path. So these dashboards from cause will help you to identify which table will benefit from search optimization and if enabled, what is the estimated cost for building the search access path, for storing search access path and to maintain search access path. So to summarize cost, that is cost optimization service for Snowflake is really very helpful to optimize the cost of Snowflake platform. Though it is not fully automated in its current state, it is providing valuable summaries to help take design decisions. Further, deployment of cost as Snowflake native application assures that your sensitive data is never moving out of Snowflake platform during the optimization process. Thank you. Thank you very much.